So here is the four month update on the Garner family farm. Uh, didn't get a whole lot done this month. I worked a lot. I think I worked 16, 12 off two and then worked 12, 12 after that. And then off two and then worked two more. Anyway, I worked most of the month of May. But we did get a couple of little things accomplished around here and I'm gonna turn you around and let you see it. So this month we had our first casualties. Uh, I came out here, it's been a few weeks now, but it came out and it appeared there were dead chickens. The dog here was the culprit. I saw a dead chicken and then I saw chickens laying everywhere. So I thought he'd killed all of them. And he did kill two, he killed two chickens and ate them. I mean, it was tore apart. Yeah, that was you. Um, but the rest of them, I was able to find, they were in little nooks and crannies in that little brick and over in the corner, they were still alive. A couple of them were hurt. But uh, I gathered all, I gathered eight of them. So he killed two and eight of them made it and I got them back in. And what had happened is the door inside here had come open. And once I realized that it was just loose, it shouldn't have came open, but it was loose. And the little goats, I think I showed you last month, they were in with the chickens out back, but they were starting to aggravate the chickens. So I got this dog pen thing here from my mom and hooked it up. So the little goats are in here and the dog keeps coming up, trying to go after them too. So I got them separated from the dog. And now the chicken coop, the walk-in for that coop is inside here. So it's like a double, double protection from the dog. The plan eventually is to put a fence out here for the dog and get him separated from all of them. Because he is a problem. Uh, and this was... This was our little chickens at first. There was 10 of them, now two of them died, so now there's only eight. I'm pretty sure we got a rooster in here. He is not showing himself. This is the original five chickens. They're right here. And the plan is I'm gonna probably open up a space between this section and that section and let all those chickens roam the area. And we've got more chickens I'm gonna show you in a minute. I'm gonna, they're gonna graduate to this box pretty soon. So anyway, here's Diesel and Lucy, and that's Alfie and I forget the name. Yeah, I forget the name of the little one. And then of course we got the garden. It is resembling a garden now. Like I said, we didn't do a whole lot of prep. It's tilled and planted, but stuff is coming up. And I tilled some extra lines that Gary has come out and planted. So, even some of that stuff is coming up. This is the newer stuff down here. I think they did those last two rolls the other day. But, we got stuff coming up. And if you remember the shed that was right there, I was able to move it back there with the tractor. Carrie's cannon shed. And here are the other 10 chickens. They are about a month old. So they would be graduating. 
Too boring, see? And up here on the front porch is the newest members of the family. We got a couple of rabbits. We got these, these, like four days ago. And here Carrie is with one on the out. We got a boy and a girl. The names is Romeo and Julie. Not Juliet, but Romeo and Julie. Yeah, uh, we got them in that little cage. I got to come up with something better than that pretty quick here. But, yep, rabbits. Cute things. Like I said, I got them in that cage, but I got to come up with something better. And here are the guinea eggs that we got from our neighbor. Uh... They're supposed to hatch any day now. We've got them off the little rotating thing. They're supposed to hatch, so we'll see. The last set we didn't get, none of them, none of them hatch. So we'll see. And this doesn't have anything to do with the farm, but it's getting warmer and we're starting to enjoy the pool quite a bit. So really, uh, really liking the pool. That's the four month update. Well, we got 20, 23 chickens now, two rabbits, four goats, a dog, and we got guinea eggs in the incubator too. We'll see what happens with them. If you like, share, subscribe, let me know what you think about the video. Remember, not all is a wonder or lost. Thanks for watching.